It's Thursday, and it's March the 2nd. I'm with Kay. We're up at Batista Creek. This is a long creek. Somewhere on this creek, people found fossils. So we're trying to figure out where. That's all we know is somewhere by the creek, but not where on the creek. So far, this section doesn't look like fossil country exactly, according to Kay. But I'll probably just grab a bucket of dirt because this is also a gold claim up here I've been on before. So uh, we'll check it out. So any indications, Kay? Um, no, and I think the fossils, remember where the car was pulled over the first one that we saw? Yeah, way at the bottom. Okay, the fossils generally settled in the lowest area, not up high like this. You might get the gold up high like this. But okay. All right, well. I'll just grab a bucket and get some dirt before we leave this spot, I guess. Yeah, yeah, this is nice. The water's running really well. You can set up a sluice box here. Now, if I was uh, by myself, I'd go up there a ways. I know one spot where gold does settle, and they found a few little nice pickers before. That would probably be the place to go. But... This is Kay's day today. I promised her we do stuff she wants to do, so that's what we're going to do. So I'm just going to just grab some dirt here anywhere just to take home. Who knows, I might find a flake. You never know. But some guy, let me show you, as soon as he drove up here, some guy got stuck up here. It looks like he's been here a while. They had a chain on it. I'm trying to pull him out right there but that didn't work so uh, yeah he's <laughs> he's down he's down in there hmm actually what I'll do is just take some dirt right here where the stream slows down a little you can even see black sands right there I am you know obviously I'm also going to end up getting sand but just for something quick so we can move on to the next spot I'll have a little something to check later on might as well Little gravels right here. There could be a little something in it. But we'll take it and see what it is. Well, anything? No. Okay. We might as well be looking in our backyard. This is all BG and forks. Okay. So we might as well go on to where you want to go then, huh? <laughs> pretty up here. Yeah, it is pretty. <laughs> but not pretty rough. <laughs> What's that? Did you get your beer? Yeah, I got it. I just got like a half bucket. I just took it next to the stream, so it's probably mostly going to be sand, but 
You never know. More likely it'd be in stuff like this. Where the heavies are. Here, maybe he's trying to get that car out of there. It's like he's backing up to it. After all these rains, when once it go, the water goes down anywhere in the gold bearing areas, this is a good place to look. Where you got these culverts, storm drain, because it acts just like a riffles in a sluice box, and you can find a lot of times gold right there. Well, I guess this area is not any good for fossils either. So we're moving on. Well, we didn't find anything. So Kay wants to go to yard sale. There she is. Well, I didn't think I'd find anything in this uh, little bit. I only had like maybe a half bucket of dirt and uh, most of it was sand and water. So, But there was a little few heavies in here, little black sands and I, uh, you probably can't see it, but I got about, I don't know, nine or ten fly poop specks. Let me see if I can show you over here. Let's see if you see any of this. Yeah, there's some in the corner there. There's one there. Let's see, get a little more water. There's a couple more there. There's, uh, there's one a little bigger. There's one there. I can say probably around eight or ten. They're all pretty small. A couple of them are a little bigger. But... There's one there. A couple of them there actually. Some more over there. Anyway, so I got a little something from Batista Creek. So I guess there's some possibilities there. I found gold up there before, not very plentiful because it hadn't rained in such a long time. It was pretty well wiped out, but now there's a fresh supply, I think. Wife just finished this, she calls it this cowboy mobile. All these swinging things on it. And she's really happy with it. Got some of my old coins in it. And there's some new coins too, rosies. But, Looks like we got a Merc down here, and all these things made out of copper. And here's some of the old square nails I found, and some friends have found that have given them to me too. Anyway, she's excited about it. She's going to take her to the art show, I think, next month. <laughs>